Okay, man, we're here with 10-4 Barbecue, and it's made of the Franklin County Sheriff's Office. And I think uh, we have the two main cookers here, and uh, I believe you're, uh, what's your name? John Solomon. Oh, okay, and uh, he's the evidence manager at the Franklin County. That's correct. Okay, and uh, man, they just, how long you put your team together? We've been together, uh, this is our third year now. Okay, and uh, y'all came together and won our first in... We won our first place in uh, butts and second place in chicken, our first competition. Wow, man, that's big. Uh, so, uh, what's your name? David Barnes. Okay, and you're the transport man. Transport, yes, sir. Okay, and uh, uh, y'all's sheriff's team put this uh, uh, together just to get out with the boys and have you a good time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> Enjoy time with the community. There you go. I'm a little intimidated. I'm over here questioning the sheriff patrol. <laughs> uh, where's Franklin County at? Franklin County's about uh, 70 miles south of Tallahassee. Okay. On the coast. Okay. Um, down in Florida ways. Yes, sir. Well, it's down right down here where St. George Island is. That's where Apalachicola and Franklin County. Okay. And then you're the jailer for the Franklin County. Yes, sir. I'm the jail administrator. Okay. <laughs> I've been good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, get out of jail free card. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, tell us about your Williams Communication Incorporated. Uh, we noticed out here on the front of their uh, uh, booth, they've got some fantastic emergency type uh, lights going on and off. And tell us a little bit about that. Well, what we did was when we got this idea together about the 10 4 barbecue, the actual team itself, what we wanted to do was encompass the sheriff's office feel. So we did jail bars in here and then we called Williams Communication. They were gracious enough to come out here and hook up all kind of lights and especially the new ones we have on the front here of the booth that normally go on cars but to put it into the, our tent booth to kind of show that what we're about. Wow so those are authentic emergency lights that uh, uh, you've got on them. We've got three more team members we want to pull in here right quick. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Scott McGuire. Okay you're actually with Williams Communications. Yes sir I'm the service manager for Williams Communications. Okay um, uh, so do you like um, manufacture or you put together the light systems and then you apply them to the cars? Yeah, we, we, we sell them to local law enforcement agencies and public safety entities. Um, so we sell and install those types of products, yes. Okay, will you be cooking with them this weekend? I will be joining them. Oh, you will? Yeah, <laughs> I'm going to get some free food out of the deal. <laughs> <laughs> and what's your name? Ryan Parr. Okay, and you're with Williams also? Yes, sir. Okay, and yeah, you're a technician that helps work and put everything together? That's correct. Okay, and what's your name? Justin Z. Okay, you look like a police officer. Uh, are you going to move into law enforcement or are you going to stay with Williams? Nah, I plan to stay with Williams. Okay. I, I got my license and, and I swear I, I got registration and everything. Uh, <laughs> well, well uh, where do you see yourself going in the next year now? Have you heard about the KCBS uh, Sam's Wholesale Chase and the total grand prize of $400,000? No, sir, we haven't heard about that yet, but we have now. <laughs> KCBS, just so you know, uh, is offering a uh, uh, chase now, and on the 21st, the 21st, what's today? Seven, 18th. 18th, so you got three days. If you guys are interested, uh, they're going to have a 24-hour period where you can sign up for any of the competitions that you want. You don't have to qualify. You just got to get signed up, and you go to the KCBF's website and, and look for the time when the window is going to be open. And then also in Las Vegas, they're going to have a competition, uh, total grand prize. Well, no, no, the grand prize, $125,000. Have you heard about that one? No, sir. Does that pique your interest at all? Yes, sir. <laughs> How about you? Peak. Very, very, very high peaks. <laughs> yes, sir, because especially all the proceeds for any of the winnings that 10-4 Barbecue has all goes to the youth fund at Franklin County Sheriff's Office for the kids in Franklin County. Oh, I think I see a challenge. Now, think about this. If they could just win half that $400,000 with the KCBS, boy, that'd be a great shot in the arm for the for the kids. That really would, because we do a lot of stuff throughout the year for the kids, movies in the park, and we have Kids and Cops Day for the kids to come down. So we do a lot for the kids, and that would really put a benefit toward it. Uh, how do you feel about helping all the kids and doing that community stuff? Oh, we love it. We like to do it and continue to do it. We have to have money to do it with, so that would sure help. Man, he kind of scares me. You know, when I ask him something, he always says a one-word answer. We love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, uh, how about you? Are you involved with the children also? Yes, we're very involved. Uh, past school resource officer. Uh, the kids are, are the most important thing that we, we have in our county. Uh, if we can get to them, give a positive 
uh, influence on them at a young age, we might not have to have contact with them at older ages. Yeah, you know, prevention is the biggest thing. And, and I tell you, uh, if somebody feels like somebody cares about them, you know, uh, the number one thing we need in this country is that people know that by God, somebody out there cares about me, and you're offering that. You know, uh, you're a credit to the community with the community service that you do and in, in your law enforcement, then also going out and helping the kids. And uh, Barbecue Superstar supports that a thousand percent. And if you don't mind, I mean, we'll put uh, this video on, a, on its own page, and then we'll put a link to your uh, charity down so people can go and donate. And uh, now think about this, friends. Uh, we got a sheriff's department that put together a substantial barbecue team, and it's totally to raise money for the children. And uh, we want you to support these guys. If you're in Franklin County, Florida, uh, uh, go by the sheriff's office, donate to their team, donate to the children, or get involved with their team somehow. If you can sponsor their team, uh, it'll mean a whole lot to the community uh, all the way around. Let's all get together and show we love each other just a little bit and support our local sheriff's department doing something good. Well, we salute you, every one of you, and we, we hope and pray that every one of you do good, and uh, we hope you all have a lot of fun. And uh, By the way, if I come back in a little while, can I get about four or five racks of them ribs? <laughs> <laughs> I got a feeling they'll get eat up before I get here. This is Daryl from Barbecue Superstar saying barbecue is about food, family, friends, and fun, and it's about wonderful people like these. And thanks for stopping by.